We're going to target the hamstrings using the roller. I'm going to start with the roller just uh, right at the base of the hamstring so we can put a little bit of weight down on it. So George, I'm just going to get you to put your hand on your thigh there and just press down again. We just want to trigger point the hamstring right in the belly of the muscle. And George is adding a bit of knee flexion here. So as he extends the, the knee, the quadriceps on, so the reciprocal muscle underneath the hamstring will have to release. Um, it's a nice way of getting that to work efficiently for us. And then from there, you can maybe just tweak it a little bit to one side. So if you just rotate it there, you can do it here. Yeah, and then rotate it in the other side. And we might bring that into play with this next technique as well. So just bend the knee. You can place your hands behind you. Let's prop you up. And we're just gonna to start to roll backwards and forwards along the length of the hamstring. So nice and close to the knee and then towards the gluteal region. We'll put weight down onto it. And here you can roll on the outside a little bit or the inside and then the outside. Good. Just take your time so that the muscle gets an opportunity to react to what you're doing there. Gets a, has an ability to release and accommodate the movement patterns. You could even put this leg on top of here if you wanted to. Place weight down it and just keep rolling. Yeah, it might be a bit harder for your arms there, but by pressing the legs together, you get a nice contact with the hamstring. Just place the foot back down and then lie back down onto it. Good. And then do the other side. Maybe a couple of minutes on each side and just compare them both. 